You didn't hear this from me, but we've uncovered the plot to kill the Emperor. <laughs> Hi everyone, and welcome to my channel. Today I'll be showing you my Imperial Ooh, Infiltrator build. Let's get started. We'll be playing an Imperial, or you can go with Orc if you want to do the main quest. Got an assassin! Check the shadows! You're a long way from the Imperial city. What are you doing in Skyrim? That's classified. <laughs> Have Hadvar sneak you to safety. Look around. There should be plenty of gear to choose from. Then get to work and start killing Stormcloak. Kill the torturer so you can get his steel dagger. And loot anything valuable. Sneak attack Hadvar when you reach the bear. Training to 100 sneak. And putting everything in health as you level up. Take the Thief Stone. The Flawless Emerald. Anything useful from Alva. and the enchanted items from the Shrine of Teller. Roll on to Riften. Show some charities. Put the guard in his place. And sell everything you don't need. Sleep at the inn. Let me know if there's anything else we need. Then listen to Lil. Then quick save in front of Sibi and pickpocket his gold. Put some gold in his pocket. Then take it back without exiting his invention. Gradually increase the amount of gold as you level. Reloading if you get caught. What do you think you're Keep training until you reach 70 pickpocket. Then get the misdirection perk. Show Grelod your steel. Then switch to the Shadow Stone. Gods, no! And wander up to Windhelm. Call on Aventus Aretina. Efficiency, efficiency, efficiency. Then sleep outside of a major city and make Astrid's acquaintance. Sleep well. Use the misdirection perk to pickpocket the Blade of Woe. Then do what must be done to infiltrate the Brotherhood. I would like to officially extend to you an invitation to join my family. To remove the stolen tag from the Blade of War, first pickpocket any weapons from an enemy. Then drop the Blade of War in front of them. They will eventually pick it up. 
which means it is time to kill them and take back the Blade of Woe, now free of the stolen tag. Then find your way to the Sanctuary and get the Shrouded Armor from Astrid. Introduce yourself to Nazir and set about burning his trust. I've got three available right now. Your targets are the Vagar Narthen, an ex Melon, who noted his backwards, and they till a mind mass. You Get a real job from Astrid Markov and speak with the apothecary's assistant. Save Margaret and Markov. And get access to the dig site from Calselmo, where you can find a dwarven dagger. Meet Muiri. Set up the contract. And carry it out. To embrace the Night Mother, then take some more work from Nizir. Do some work for him. Your first target is an orc bard named Lurby. The other is a vampire by the name of Fern. And uncover the plot. A secret assassination. What the? Implicate Astrid. <laughs> the damn right will accept it. Then assemble your evidence against Motier and his new co-conspirators. An assassin in service to the King of Black Marsh. I'm a werewolf. I like to kill things. The Great Desert. Blood is a shape of crimson and scarce to scribe. Thicken oh, the yes. blots. You've got to kill the bride at her wedding. Make your way to solitude. Watch a traitor die. And take the opportunity to buy an enchanted ring and necklace. I would suggest archery or sneak. And remember that one-handed enchantments don't affect daggers. If you sneak off at Victoria's wedding, you can find an enchanted elven bar. Eliminate your target. Mingle with the guests. And take the Penitus Oculatus armor once Vizara kills the bodyguard. By the blood, the blood, the blood. Keep up with the side contracts. I need you to eliminate an old woman named Agnes. And you can either get a second dwarven dagger from Mchunzel or buy an elven dagger. See Gabriella for the next phase. Then steal the schedule and wait around for Gaius Mara. Being old is not so bad. Mara keeps me dead. My working days are done. What? Speaking to him no, turns him hostile. We'll see who lies dead. Then use the Shadow Warrior perk to take him down with sneak. Return to the Sanctuary for a Lava's token. 
then hear the reviews of Cicero's performance, and behold Shadow Me. Get a reading from a lava. Then cut your way through deep with readout, and sneak up to Hag's End. Once you've dealt with the cover, pull the lever behind the throne, and claim the ancient shrouded gear. Get back to the Cicero situation. Sneak through the sanctuary and send his soul to Sippus. Keep up with the side contract and Helvar, the house call of Falcon. You need to find and kill Safi. I'm afraid I can complete our business. Then find Festus for the next assignment. Track down Anton. Tie off the loose ends. And carve up the dual man. Take his writ of passage and dispose of the evidence. I Gourmet. I Assume the Gourmet's identity. I should have realized. Then identify the flaws in the Emperor's security. The Gourmet has killed the Emperor! Attack! That's and witness Mara's madness. You killed my son, all of you, and now you'll pay the price. Return to the sacking of the sanctuary. And when you find Astrid, you can then get a second blade of woe. Then end her life. Where did you come from? Thank you. And the Brotherhood. Track down Motier for his final confession. I still do. Then bring your evidence to the Emperor himself. You haven't come this far just to stand there talking. Receive your new orders. Then dishonorably discharge Commander Mara. And execute the traitor. He is unfortunately marked essential until you kill the Emperor. So he actually needs to die to progress the story. Rather than rebuild the Dark Brotherhood, you should invest the payment in Proud Spire Man. You first need to complete the Man Who Cried Wolf and Elisif's task. Now that the Emperor is safe, you can see to the storm close. Speak to General Tullius, then take Ricker's test. And the Imperial Oath. Tag along the Corvangian, then go behind enemy lines and recover the Jagged Crown. Then take a message to White Rock. You're forced to start the main quest at this point. So make sure you get some lesser soul gems to recharge the Blades of War. When you face the dragon, your best bet is to hide in the tower and shoot it from afar. Die, dragon! Play messenger again. Before infiltrating the Stormcloak position and slaughtering the straggler. Intercept Stormcloak couriers and falsify their reports. Extort Stormcloak stewards. Slaughter Stormcloak sympathizers. And 
a great storm token here. Sneak into enemy fort. Free the imprisoned Imperial. Let's teach these bastards a lesson. And return the garrisons to Imperial control. Then join the assault on Windhelm. And end the Stormcloak Rebellion. Then begin your preparations for the next great war by hunting down Palma Spy. And assassinating the agents of the Old Mary Dominion. Well that's it for this build. Thanks for watching and a special thank you to everyone who subscribes to my channel, leaves a comment or likes the video. If you have any comments or suggestions, I'd love to hear them. Thanks again and I'll see you next time.